Hey, it's Austin from Turbo Lab, and I wanted to show you this uh, 6.0 Ford Turbo upgrade that we did. Uh, it has a 63 and a half by 88 by 90 millimeter compressor wheel, or 92 millimeter compressor wheel, and the turbine side of this, we ended up putting a 10 blade 66 by 70 turbine the 10 blade which is a popular 2003 shaft I had to machine the exhaust housing and I had to machine the compressor housing this right here is the largest turbo that you want to go with before you lose all your turbo or towing capabilities because if you go with the larger GT40 shaft then it's get to the point where you're not going to have the kind of spool time you need for to for towing which kind of makes it pointless because that's kind of the main point of having a truck in the first place so to give you an idea of what we had to do here I made a little bit of a short video on the machining process this is a turbo upgrade that we offer we do offer to sell the parts too it just depends on what you want to do and what you're comfortable with doing. Uh, if you're looking for a turbo upgrade like this, you can always contact us at TurboLabAmerica at Gmail. So to get you an idea of what we went from and to on the compressor wheel, the original compressor wheel is 59 millimeter by 82, and that varies by the truck. There's probably three or four different types of compressor wheels that the 6.0 uh, turbo comes with so you could have a smaller one you could have a larger one and uh, you know we went to a compressor wheel at 63.5 millimeter and it's an extended wheel and it uh, the exducer is 88 millimeter and that tapers to 92 and it threads right on, it's already balanced and ready to install. The turbine we went to and from is, uh, originally this turbine is the same measurement. The only difference is the tip height is taller on this shaft. However, it depends on what power stroke you have, or what power stroke turbo you have, because there are like two or three different versions of this shaft which are smaller this is actually the larger one and then this one is the upgrade this one makes a much louder whistle which some people prefer because it has the 10 blades this one's a 13 blade so this one will outflow the 13 blade as far as horsepower wise the capability of this turbo uh, I don't really know the diesel market that well uh, but I do know a turbo this size is good for over 800 horsepower so here's a little bit of the machining process for the Ford 6.0 turbo upgrade. So I just machined the exhaust housing for the Ford 6.0 and I wanted to give you some tips on how to do it if you're looking to do that yourself. Check the original shaft in relation to this piece because there's different power stroke turbos that have different size veins. So if you check it in relation to this piece with the stock shaft, you can check how far the shaft needs to go in. And check how far the shaft vein is from this piece. Now in my case, these would be lined up together, but there's another vein that's much taller and it would go in much deeper. It's actually pretty easy to line this up on the machine if you have the correct size. I think my chuck is like a 16 inch. And to see it spinning. This really isn't that complicated to machine that. Any uh, machine shop should be able to figure that out. 